participate. Ravenous. Watchful. Dip. Admire. Loveliness. Grumble. Clamp. Investigate. Graciously. Ray. Gloomy. Puff. Praise. Polish. Ebony. Tremendous. Blinking. Triumphant. Scoop. Lick. Steel. Lizard. Selfish. Whole. Intend. Intent. Intention. Intentional. Intentionally. Pretend. Tend. Tendency. Tender. Tense. Tension. Intense. Intensive. Intensity. Don't bite off more than you can chew. Don't assume more responsibility than you can handle. Don't be overconfident. Hold on there, Sam. Where are you running off to? Oh, hi, Lloyd. Can't stop the chat. I'm already late for work. It seems like you're always busy lately. If it's not work, it's studies or something else. You don't have time for your friends anymore. When you took that full-time job, I warned you, don't bite off more than you can chew. I think you were right. Now I see that it was a mistake to take on too much responsibility all at once. My grades in school are already starting to go down. There you are. Why don't you cut down on your hours at work and maybe drop a course or two, at least for this semester? Maybe I'll do that. At this rate, my health is liable to suffer too. Don't bite the hand that feeds you. 
Don't hurt someone who takes care of you. Julie, I simply can't understand you. I've worked my fingers to the bone, and I've saved and scrimped to pay for your college education. And here you go running off to get married without finishing school. Hasn't anyone ever told you, don't bite the hand that feeds you? You must know how disappointed I am. I'm sorry, Dad. I don't mean to hurt you after all you've done for me. And I have every intention of going back to school after Al and I get settled. He's got a great job overseas, and he wants me to go with him as his wife. Still, I find it difficult to approve of your decision to quit school now when you're about to get your degree. Don't be hasty. Why don't you give this a little bit more thought? <laughs> 